Hey guys, this is Poet Spice Jamie Little 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 Lynn, and I'm here to do a collective haul. I got stuff in from HSN's Crafters Companion. By the way, just a heads up, there is a craft event, a 24-hour craft event on HSN on the 13th of August, which is in a few days. Also, today, which is Saturday, they are having free shipping on any everything. So there are some items that are up in the show for the 13th that you can go ahead and purchase now for free shipping, although they do not have the flex pay unless you have um, one of their HSN cards. So that's a heads up, so you can go ahead and get some of the items now. I've already purchased a few items, plus I did some today um, for the free shipping. Um, let's see, so that's a heads up on that. And then um, I have three D stash lots that I reduced last night um, and combined them. So if you're interested in embossing folders or stamps or something else, there's a third one. Go check out those videos or if you know anybody who is, um, you could also try a best offer and we can see what's going on with that. All right, let me go ahead and get into this. First, I want to show this cute card that I got from Jill. She is Love My Two Pugs One, although I think she changed her YouTube channel name. Um, but from Jill, isn't that cute? I love that. She always makes such cute cards. I love them. She put a little note on the front, and you can see her little pug in the back. She's so cute. All right, so thanks, Jill. I am so bad because I make cards with the intentions of sending them out to people, and then they sit here for like a month, and then I'm like, oh. <laughs> It's so terrible. All right, so that was from Jill. So thanks, Jill. And uh, yeah, I have to start work on Wednesday of this week. And you guys know, I'm not all feeling that yet. And I have a major head. I've had a headache all day. And when I close my eyes, parts of the room start spinning. And I'm like, ugh, terrible. Anyway. I got in this package from Doodle Bug Wah, and I, they ship quickly. And I mean, I, I don't know. This <laughs> she is on it because like I placed my order, and like within a couple hours, I got a notice that says, "Hey, package is shipped." Now, of course, when you go look at it, it's just the shipping label made, but it was like, "Dang, that's real quick." <laughs> So she is on it, and I got it within, mm -hmm, I want to say three or four days. It was, it was fast. So I love that. They also have shipping at thirty dollars. So if you spend thirty dollars, um, it's free shipping. And it used to be twenty five, but you know shipping costs have gone up. So I think that is a fabulous deal because when you look at it, um, if you look at a, a discount, it, it can go either way. So if you have like a ten percent discount, ten percent may cover the shipping right and then if you have free shipping it may be the same as having a 10 percent discount so it's i love it so anyway there you go i got the what is this one called warm and feathered hugs because she had these on 35 percent off so i was like yes and i've been wanting this dot this stamp and die set but you know me i'll wait i don't like paying full price i will sometimes but i don't like to so this was 35% off, I was like, yes. Then, you know, I have been on a lawn fawn kick since that wheel die I saw. And um, so I purchased these because these were in her 35% off section as well. So these little rabbits, and it's an Easter stamp, so to speak, but you don't ever have to use a stamp or die for what it's quote unquote supposed to be for. Um, I mean, like this right here. So it looks like, I don't know, can you see that? There you go. So this little bunny, the way it's on here, it looks like it's like reaching for that little egg. But the little bunny, she could be balleting, she could be dancing, she could be reaching up to like shake a big mommy's hand. She could be trying to balance that. She could be flying, pretend she's flying. So you could do that. This one looks like it's jumping, okay? But it could be reaching up to get a hug, all right? Um, sometimes, depending on how they design it, if you cut off the ears, it could be a bear. So instead of putting the, the rabbit ears, like that could be a bear right there. 
and just take that off or put like a little hat on top of it so you don't see the ears. There's a little bear. Um, over here, if you cut the ears down and then just put a line, it'll look like a cat. So just, just remember you can do different things with your stamps, okay? So this little basket, I thought this was so cute. I did 35% off. <laughs> and of course, you know I don't like a stamp without a die. So there you go. I was very happy. Yay, yay. So, yes, I'm loving Doodle Bug Wall. I go between, <laughs> because they always have the the MFT. So I go between Doodle Bug Wall, Jamie's Shop, the Not Too Shabby Shop, and the MFT site to get the different things. <laughs> Which brings me to my next one. Doodlebug Wa didn't have the stamp set. So, guess where I went? I went to MFT. So, this is what I got at MFT. Right now, I don't know how long it lasts, but as of when I ordered this, it was shipping at $25. So, if you paid, if you had $25, it was ship, free shipping. Instead of, I think they're usually $50. So, I was trying to get my little thing up to the amount so I got this brown hybrid ink and I'm loving the hybrids because you can do watercolor or alcohol and not have to worry about it so I got a brown one and I wanted to try this against the spectrum noirs to do a comparison you got a free gift which was so cute wishing you a happiest birthday so they got this little giraffe on the pogo stick but you can turn around and use that same sentiment for that rabbit so that's why i say mix your stamps up and so forth all right the next thing i got from mft was the stamp to go with that die and there was some kind of discount on this because i wouldn't have bought it full price but there was some kind of discount on this one and it's so cute look at that I just loved how adorable they are. This one is rocking my world. Ever since I saw the release, I'm like, ah, so adorable. But you know, like I said, I'm not paying full price most of the time. Um, case in point, this this stamp set here. I think I did pay full price for this one because it's a it's a new release, and uh, so but. That is so cute. And I'm not real big on Halloween, even though I do like gothic. I'm not real big on Halloween itself. But this little mouse, I don't know what is with me in mice. Because the lawn fawn mice that are coming out for December, they also have a, a Thanksgiving one that they came out with a few years ago. Somebody else had some mice and I'm like, these are so cute. But I don't like mice in real life. But look at that mouse. He is getting his Halloween groove happiness on. Right, right. Look at his little face. And then the the rabbit is my second favorite because he is or he or she is getting it. And then I like these pumpkins. Sometimes I'm not really into like the whole pumpkin thing because they either look too scary or too cartoony. Um and or they don't and they don't push it far enough one way or the other. So I'm like, if I like it cartoony, then I want it like cartoony, cartoony. If I want it scary, then I want it kind of scary. Now, I don't mean demented. Well, sometimes I do mean demented scary, but anyway. But anyway, okay, I'm rambling. I'm sorry. This is what happens when my head hurts. I, I lose focus. <laughs> and I can't read these to you because I can't see them very well. So hopefully that's close enough for you to read. So you can get this at uh, Doodle, well, I don't know if Doodle Bug Wall has it in now, but you can get it at MFT. <coughs> and Jamie had it on her shop too. Okay, next. This is not new, but this is what I pulled out to do something else. So I have these dies and it came with this Spellbinder Sapphire. So if you remember a while ago, I ordered four of these and one because i wanted to try it and then the other three were for giveaways so this die set was in there and so i finally pulled this out to use it so i just thought i would show that not a brand new item but a new item i used this actually just came today in the mail downstairs and it's i don't know 
I've been babyfied <laughs> with my paper choice for my collab. And so I saw this die and I was like, I must have this. It's too cute. So you can see it's got the little, all the little accoutrement and then a backing layer. And then they give you the dies that you can use by itself or layer up. So you can put the shoes on there and do like a decoupage. So that just came. I was like, how cute, how cute is that? Like literally. I believe I showed you these. So I'm just going to flip through this real quick. These were two sets of stamp and dies from Sheena. Uh, they're actually tattered lace. You can always tell when it's like a tattered lace thing because like the packaging. So even though they're a different color, you could tell by the, how the packaging is designed. And so those, but I think I showed you that. I'm not sure if I showed you this one. And then these are the items that I got from Crafters Companion that are supposed to be new on the um, 13th, but you can get a bunch of these now. Like I said, a couple of these, I, well, all of this I got a couple of weeks ago. So like over, I ordered a couple of weeks ago. Okay, so first, I love this. I don't do this very often, but I love me some gingerbread stuff like little gingerbread men gingerbread girls they're so cute i love it i actually do like gingerbread i don't bake it though oh child honey i cannot bake and so these are the layering stamps and it has three stamps and then you get this look and so what i ordered today for the free shipping is i went and ordered the brown uh quick dry ink for this so i can't wait to that comes to do this so cool i love this and then it came as a pair uh, and the set comes with it. I cannot talk right. So the set that comes with it is winter pine and you get your three pieces and you layer it up to get that 3D look. Um, I already have the greens and then um, I ordered the browns and I think these two browns along with that brown come in the same set. So I loved that. Let me know if you would like to see a demo on either or both of those. So once I get that ink in, then let me do the auto ship first. Um, auto ship. This is uh, when the Gemini came out with the teal. Remember they had all the colors. They had the pink and the black and the teal. And I got the teal one, the Gemini Junior. Well, it comes with the auto ship, and this is the first set of auto ships. So this is an edger die, and it matches the next die. So you got the edge die here, and the smaller version there. And you can use these to create all kinds of stuff. You can put it on the card, over the edge of the card, make it the, the make it the edge of the card. You can make it do um, like a inner flip kind of thing. Um, you could just use it to layer up and then edge. Now this one doesn't have a cutting edge on this side, which would have been perfect. I wish they had done that. Um, if they had put another cutting edge on there, that would have been fabulous. But um, so yeah, you can use this like that. And I'm hoping these are a little bit deeper. Okay, then it comes with the full frame, which no, I was thinking maybe you could use this, but it doesn't work. Okay, so then you get the full frame. And what I liked about this set is you still get intricacy and you get embossing, but it was like a thicker kind of lace instead of a thinner one. So you get that variety. They put little flowers in here, some swirls. Like this is repeated swirl. They have that in like tons of dyes. And it says thank you on this one. So I love that from Crafters Per uh, Compete. You know who that's from. All right, this is not Crafter's Companion, but this was from Create and Craft, and it is the Paper Boutique, and I love this Berry Christmas doily. So there's a backing layer, there's the inner piece with all the detail, and I love how they have these circles. So instead of pin dots, it actually cuts out those little circles. Then you have some more of the little berries and stuff, and then, what's this say? I think it says Berry Christmas. And you know I do like a pun. So yeah, it does say Merry Christmas. So that's what they look like. Let's see, look at that. I love that. So I can't wait to play with that. Now, this is the new double-sided die from a crafter's companion. And it is along the lines of, you know, your stamping layers. Um, it's along the lines of like a 3D decoupage, but not in the same way that Tattered Lace does 3D. And so 
I saw the peony and I was like, I didn't realize it was a, a double-sided die. I just liked the die at first. I was like, oh, that's pretty. I have a thing for peonies. And um, I don't know why. I think that's because they're big and they're just pretty flowers. I love flowers. Flowers and butterflies are about as girly as I get. Well, glitter. Glitter, too. But. And I've actually had a die that's similar to this. And it was more like a Spellbinders or a Quick Cuts die. But the die is actually double-sided. So you can cut two pieces at the same time um, one is less detailed and then the other was detailed and then you have another piece to layer up so I don't know what I did with the one I did for the peony but the next set that they had and this is supposed to be the auto ship I didn't like the other ones in the auto ship so I just got this one it comes with the rose and it's double-sided and it comes with this one which is what a dahlia this one I'm not thrilled with it, Mm. It looks better in the picture, but I'm like, meh, not really thrilled about that. Could be the colors I use, but meh. The rose I definitely like in the peony. And it this set comes with these Gemini Junior plates. And you these are supposed to um, help protect your other clear plates from getting damaged from these double-sided because you'll have extra pressure. Now let me show you at least these two because I don't know where the peony is. Here is the, the what is that one called? A dahlia. So it's not terrible. I think it would be better with some um, inking or something on it to make it look a little bit more like not a hot mess because it just looks like scattered stuff to me. Okay. And the camera is not so bad. And I love the leaves. So what is cool is they gave you different types of leaves in each one of these packs instead of repeating it. So you get those leaves in this dahlia pack. And I just cut it twice and put it on there. And then look at the rose. The rose is gorgeous. Look at that. Right? So it's four layers. Uh, well, not including the leaves. The leaves have two layers. And then the flowers, four layers. And you could really do... The, only, the background layer is the only layer that's like, mm, I don't think you could really do anything without that, without drawing on it. The rest of the layers are pretty in and of themselves. So when you put them together, it's fabulous. If you are interested in a tutorial, I have a tutorial up on how to do this. So I will put that in the link up here somewhere or below so that you can see how these dies work and then you can actually see what it looks like um, the dye itself. All right. Thanks for watching and I hope you have a lovely day. Please check out the other D stash videos because I really want to get rid of that stuff. <laughs> you could try a best offer and see that. Um, and I will be back again for my collab videos. Bye. Thanks. Like, share.